Over in Germany, it's the first day of tighter lockdown restrictions. This ahead of Christmas. Let's cross to Berlin. Correspondent Emmanuel Schaas is with us. Uh, Emmanuel, the uh, tighter measures being felt immediately. Immediately. In fact, this title lockdown came into effect today. All non-essential shops are closed. All schools are closed at least until January the 10th. It could be also longer. Uh, this uh, gave actually uh, um, a place to uh, very peculiar scenes yesterday evening. Uh, for example, here in the Berlin, in the German capital in Berlin, with people queuing for hours uh, to uh, finish their Christmas shopping. Also, uh, people were, were seen panic buying in supermarkets markets even if supermarkets uh, don't suffer from any shortages or uh, are not threatened with uh, closure. But ahead of, uh, of Christmas, the situation is quite peculiar here under this new uh, lockdown. But this is a lockdown that was actually uh, uh, welcomed by Germans. 70% of Germans uh, were actually uh, seeing it positively as Germany is seeing a very, very grim situation now. Today, record number of deaths, of COVID-related deaths, 950 and more than 20. 27, new, uh, 27,000 new um, infections in a single day. The seven days incidence rate of the virus has also been skyrocketing in some regions. There's a nationwide uh, average of 180, but in some regions such as Saxony, which is the worst affected, this goes way above 320 per 100,000 inhabitants. So a very dire situation. In fact, this is the most critical uh, time. The first wave was, was very well sustained here in Germany. Many, but it is, this is no longer the case. And uh, Bavarian State Premier uh, Marcus Söder said a few days ago that the scenes we've seen in Italy in the spring where uh, the military had to come uh, and help to uh, move uh, corpses from overwhelmed hospitals, well, those scenes were no longer something that were unimaginable here in Germany. That's to tell you how serious the situation is. Yeah, and the, we, the, this on the day when the World Health Organization has urged Europeans to wear face masks during Christmas dinners. Uh, Emmanuel, you're in Berlin ahead of Christmas. There's not many hours of light during the day uh, in that part of Germany at this time of the year. What's morale like? I think it's just uh, very, very gloomy at the moment. There's a pretty you know, a uh, gloomy atmosphere, grim feeling. Uh, people are, of course, waiting for the vaccine to be approved. It could be approved as early as next week with uh, the vaccination campaign uh, being rolled out in the end of the coming year. But so far, this is only a hope. There's nothing uh, concrete. And uh, Germans are also wondering a little bit why they don't have access to that vaccine, which is already approved in the UK and in the US, especially since uh, you mentioned it, this has been a vaccine developed by a German firm, Biontech. All right. Yeah, Emmanuel Chaz, many thanks for that live update uh, from Berlin.